Hello friends, welcome to the new session. Today we will see introduction of projection of solids, the basic concepts. Projection of solids generally comes for 20 to 22 marks. This is Professor Rajesh K. Behera, faculty from AP Shah Institute of Technology. Solids basically are divided into two categories and kept as group A and group B. In group A, we will have those solids whose top and base shape are same. In group B, we have kept those solids whose base shapes are different coming up and at the top, they will always have an apex. Cylinder, we are keeping in group A where we see always the base shape and the top shape remains the same as a circle. In prism, there are many shapes available. Few of them are shown here. In see, if you see the base, triangular base is there, then top also there will be a triangle. If at the bottom it is a square, at the top also it will be a square and similar one for pentagon and hexagon. If these edges, right, if these edges are equal, all these edges are equal, then we get cube. Cube is a solid which will have six square faces, just like the case of dice, which you will have seen. In group B, we see cone, where the base is a circle and at the top, we will have an apex. Similar one for pyramids, we will have different, different shapes of the base, but at the top, we will always have an apex. Here it is a triangular pyramid, square pyramid, pentagonal pyramid and hexagonal pyramid. Just like the case of cube in this group A, here we have tetrahedron. Tetrahedron is a solid which will have all these edges, right? All these edges of equal length. It becomes a tetrahedron. It is basically a triangular pyramid with equal length. Now we'll see some parameters of solids which generally come as a statement while we are solving it. For square prism, square pyramid, cylinder and cone. See here, this is will be this will be a top surface of the square prism. This we say as a rectangular face. This we define as a longer edge. Here it is a corner, then base edge and base of the prism, base of the prism and top of the prism remains the same always. Then in square pyramid, we will always have an apex. The moment we say pyramid, it will always have an apex at the top. Then slant edge, also called as long edge. Then base surface, it is a square pyramid. So square, if it is a triangle pyramid, triangle. Here yeah, this is an edge of the base and a corner of the base. This is also a triangular face. This slant edge is also called as longer edge and this base edge or edge of the base is also called as shorter edge. Cylinder and cone, they are always made up of n number of generators. We only represent extreme generators. These are the extreme generators. These are the extreme generator. These are all imaginary in nature. This is the base of the cylinder. And this is an apex of cone. Base of cone. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to get the updates. Thank you.